what's up y'all welcome back to the channel so if you watch my instagram live follow me on instagram first of all at abracadabra xoxo i'm gonna put the link in the bio or whatever but yeah y'all i told y'all that i was gonna give a update on the face pill that i did here y'all remember if you have not watched that video make sure you get a chance to watch it that's how uh, a part of my skincare routine is i do a chemical face pill on myself once or twice a year so um either i do it on myself or i go to a medical spa and have it done this time i actually did it on myself 15 percent the um video will be linked in the description so right now um a lot of people i did tell you on uh, in the comments on that video that i was going to do a 25 percent pill but as it looks right now just take a look at my skin right now i only have on blush i filled in my brows or you know sculpted my brows i have on some eyeliner and i have on some lashes but if you see my skin right now i don't have on any foundation so um i did just take a walk <laughs> so i am a little dewy because of that or a little glowy because of that but other than that this is my natural skin right here so with that being said i do not actually need to do a 25 percent face pill there's there's no absolutely no need for me to do a 25 percent face pill on myself um it will be counterintuitive really like i i would be pretty much damaging my skin because that's um that's acid so what i will say is what i've been doing since i did that face peel because it was winter time when i did it so it's been a few months and um since i've done it as you can see like my skin is not dry and cracked like it was when i first got it done when i was that that was my concern is i had some dry cracked skin and i wanted to get that pill done to get rid of that so uh and this was like a main area for me but Right now I have like a really clean slate to put on foundation and the reason why I do is because I've been maintaining my skin in between time. I'm going to show you all the products that I use. Um, so what I do once a week or depending on how I feel, you know, I get, you got to listen to your body. It's once a week or every other week. I'll put this on my face, the ordinary. Okay. There's a glare y'all. I am going to put a picture it, there's a glare so i'm just gonna put a picture of it up on the screen somewhere i use the ordinary on my face and this right here is an aha 30 percent bha 22 uh, percent um acid so this is just uh not as abrasive as actually putting 15 percent tca pill on my face so it's a different type of acid and i put this on my face and it helps maintain my skin um after i do that every day in the morning in the evening i guess i'll put this here i hope it's in frame um i use this right here as a moisturizer um, before i was using the clinique moisture surge um right now i'm budgeting my budget has changed so this is like 20 dollars cheaper or 10 10 15 20 dollars cheaper so i've been using this i use this in the morning in the evening um also i use a aha and bha um acid so it's not a um high percentage i'll i'll show you a picture of it i'll insert a picture of it here i get it off of amazon i use that on my body and i use it on my face so i my skin is prone to like what do they call that like strawberry skin or something Y'all, the sun is going down, but like when people have strawberry legs or something, I forgot the the medical term for it. But in order to combat that and to have smooth skin, skin like soft skin, like when my man touches me, like you know, I want to be soft, like like somebody's grandma or something, you know, like just some real, like a baby, not somebody's grandma. Scratch that, get that out your mind, like like a baby. I want to have soft skin. So what I do is um i will shave and then i like exfoliate a lot so i use a pretty much a like chemical exfoliant pretty much and i do that almost every other day especially if i'm wearing um makeup a lot yes like i need to make sure i'm getting that makeup out of my skin off of my face now that is everything that i put on the outside of my body so let me tell you it also starts from within along with genetics so genetically i guess you can tell i have 
pretty decent skin, okay? So um, what I do to help keep it decent is I do, I put those face pills on, I use those chemical acids and things like that. And then I also drink lots of water. So I drink so much water, y'all. Like I drink a lot of water and then also I make smoothies. Um, I'm probably gonna make a video on the smoothies that I've been drinking because they've been helping me with my weight gain y'all i'll be drinking like 2000 calorie smoothies because i'm really trying to get it like i'm trying to get the weight in healthy so i haven't been gaining as much as i could gain if i just eat whatever because i've been eating healthy foods which is kind of hard for me to get all those calories in because the foods are as a matter of fact let me show y'all what my stomach is looking like so y'all know i just had the baby so this is what my stomach is looking like right now y'all know i just had the baby so this is what my stomach is looking like right now with all the working out hope y'all can see <laughs> let me step back yeah with all the working out i was really looking to gain weight but eating healthy has also like had me like gain weight and lose weight like my stomach has been going down and everything so yeah so you know it's not as um bloated as it was before so as you can see how, how they be doing <laughs> but yeah y'all like it's from the side how everything looks i don't even know if you can see with that thing in the background but let me get up closer Anyways, we're we not here for that. <laughs> I'm all off subject. Okay, y'all, sorry. So, um, I've been drinking a lot of water. I've been drinking smoothies. Um, what I put in my smoothies is I put, this is gonna gross y'all out. Don't worry about it. I put beef liver in my smoothies. I put whole milk, beef liver, but it's dried beef liver. There's some capsules that I'm taking. I'll insert a picture. Um, I got them off of Amazon. I put those in there. That's good for energy. I put beef liver in there. I put raw eggs in there. I put yogurt, whole milk yogurt. I put whole milk in it. Um, some strawberries and bananas, some type of fruit, you know, definitely bananas. I put oatmeal in there. I put flax seeds, wheat germ, and um, coconut oil I put coconut oil in there and coconut milk in there so I believe that's it but I'm pro I think I'm forgetting something but I do that y'all I'm still sweating from that walk but I do all of that to get my vitamin E in and get those B vitamins in because um, that's good for your skin too that helps and I also put gelatin in there for the collagen I knew I was being something but I, I if y'all want me to just leave it in the comments I'll show you what type of smoothie I'm making but yeah I drink a lot of water um, I also take digestive enzymes that's been helping my stomach to um, avoid being bloated taking the digestive enzymes um, I take a B complex uh, actually I take geritol I take liquid geritol it's a high potency B uh, vitamin that I take with iron uh, so that keeps me really active and then I also take a vitamin C so that also, you know, determines like what you put in your skin. And like I said, I'm growing my natural hair back. So um, this also is good for my hair. And that is pretty much the gist of it. That's what I do on the outside and that's what I do on the inside. Um, also, before I leave y'all, what I'm going to say is I am going to do the 25% peel, but I'm going to do it on my legs and um, I'll probably do it on my butt. I'll probably do it on my whole lower body. Y'all let me know don't let me know I'm just gonna do it <laughs> don't, don't comment on that I'm gonna put it on my whole lower body and I'm also gonna put it on my feet so I'm gonna peel my whole lower body with the 25% acid and um, I'll get that done as soon as possible and then I'll up to upload it because I want to have some really nice soft skin and then that's just that on that y'all um, thank you so much for watching uh, following the journey y'all be easy Peace.